Things you will need for your check-in table. Alcohol pads. Disinfectant and paper towels. Your temperature taker with batteries. Gloves. Parts for your plexiglass shield. And of course, your plexiglass. Installing your temperature taker. Remove the temperature taker from the box. Remove the plate from the back of the temperature taker. Place the batteries inside of the temperature taker. Oh no, make sure you have the right batteries. Now that we have the right batteries, let's quickly show you how to install them. Please read instructions carefully. Now let's go over installing the plexiglass shield. You'll need a pair of pliers, a pair of scissors, and a Phillips screwdriver. The package should come with four nuts, four bolts, and legs for the plexiglass. There are four additional screws that will not be needed for this install. Now we're removing the paper just enough to reveal the four holes at the bottom of the plexiglass. Remember to read the instructions. Start by placing the bracket at the bottom of the plexiglass by matching up the holes of the bracket with the holes in the plexiglass. Then push the nut through and add the bolt to the nut. Repeat to the other side. Do not over tighten. You do not want to crack the plexiglass. Once you're done installing the brackets to the bottom of the plexiglass, you can now remove the rest of the paper from the plexiglass. The reason why we didn't remove it before is because we did not want to scratch the glass. Let's see how the glass looks. How is it, Jimmy? Thumbs up. Looks like Jimmy is eagerly waiting his first check-in. Look, it's a staff member. Jimmy starts by asking the staff member to place their head close to the plexiglass while he checks their temperature. Looks like her temperature is under 100 degrees. Jimmy gives her the thumbs up and she's good to go. Oh, look who's here. It's Jerry. He's not looking too good today. A hundred two degrees. Sorry, buddy. Maybe next time. Make sure that anyone with a temperature higher than 100 degrees is sent away. After each reading, you should wipe down your temperature taker with an alcohol swab. Make sure you allow some time to dry before using the temperature taker again. After cleaning your temperature taker, dispose of your glove by grabbing the cuff of one glove, encompassing the dirty glove in your other glove, 
reach under the glove and dispose of your dirty gloves. Oh look, it's our first camper for check-in. The parent is asked to look over a few questions. Has your child in the last 24 hours had any fevers or chills? sore throat, new loss of taste or smell, cough, shortness of breath or trouble breathing, or looking or acting like they're getting sick. Make sure to indicate on the sign-in sheet a P for pass, an F for failed, or an A for absent, an initial to confirm that you have taken their temperature. Things to keep in mind when taking temperatures. Sometimes you will get a low message on the temperature gauge. This doesn't mean that the batteries are low. It just means that you're not close enough to get an accurate reading. A little disclaimer, Jerry wasn't really sick. He's just fine. Yes, sir.